Good day and welcome. Today we will be changing out the pre and post filter on a point of use RO system. First step is to cut the water supply off to the RO system. That should be done by the stock valve on the main water line. So we will just twist that water line valve to off. Once we've done that, you want to go over to the holding tank. The holding tank should have a valve at the top and you can actually cut the supply off there. Once that has been complete, you want to go to the faucet and drain pressure from the system. Now the system does not have pressure built up on the housings. You also need your spanner wrench. Apply the spanner wrench to your filter housing and you want to turn this at a clockwise motion. Note, paper towels come in handy at this point. You will unscrew the housing from the unit. Inside you will have your cartridge. Simply pour out the old cartridge. You're going to grab the new cartridge, place it in the filter housing, and we will reassemble the housing back on the unit by turning counterclockwise, of course. Give it a little snug with your spanner wrench. Dry all loose water from the vessel. You want to cut your supply tank back on. We're going to push out the water from the system so that all air has been removed. Then you will shut that down and then simply cut your valve back on for your water supply. And this is how we change the pre and post filter on a RO system. Thank you.